Hi, I'm Anna Lanakis Baker. I'm the executive director of Greater Boston PSR, founded in 1961 in Boston as the founding chapter of PSR National. Uh, this year, 2020, we had several challenges we faced, um, not unlike many others, and one of which was with COVID-19, we had to take our Longwood Symphony Orchestra partnership, our third and final year, online and make it virtual. It was in person in the beautiful Jordan Hall for two years and it was such a wonderful event. And we had struggled to figure out what, how, how we would make this work. Um, and so this year we decided to figure out uh, some kind of capability to do it from the comforts of our home. And we partnered again with IPPNW, the International Physicians for the Prevention of Nuclear War, also based in Boston, founded in the 1980s. And we had Secretary William Perry, the 19th Secretary of Defense under Bill Clinton as our honoree. And we had several of our GBPSR board members speak and present, and it wound up being a really wonderful evening. We hope you'll check out the recording on our website, which is gbpsr.org. Um, also this year, we fought again, the Weymouth Compressor Station, which had been um, slated to be built in the tight-knit town of Weymouth, Massachusetts. And unfortunately, even though we warned of real risks over a year ago in several reports that you should also check out on our website, um, the federal government and the local government um, had all allowed this perm to be permitted. And so the compressor station is in the process of being built. Unfortunately, on September 11th, 2020, even though the plant is not operational, um, 265,000 cubic feet were released of natural gas, fracked gas, into the air. And so even though we had warned of these risks and the plant is not yet operational, um, problems are already occurring. They just experienced, the plant just experienced another uh, natural gas release um, a couple of weeks ago. And finally, the governor, who has been very difficult to reach, um, also agreed that the plant should not be operating in such condition. Uh, we are worried that once these fixes are made, uh, the plant will be operational again and it will be put online. And it's not a safe area to put a plant in, and we are fighting that. And we'll continue to do that in 2021. And we need all the support we get from legislators and people like you to speak up about the risk of that type of a plant in that type of a community that's never been placed. A plant like this has never been placed in a community so tight uh, before. It's not safe. It's not healthy. Um, also in 2021, we're really looking forward to um, being a part of the Allendale Coalition, which is a coalition of groups across the state of Massachusetts focused on climate change impacts and disproportionate impacts on communities of color and impoverished communities. And we look to try to raise awareness and um, educate people and pull folks in um, to the issue surrounding the risks of climate change on local communities. Uh, we also, in 2020, uh, spent some time collaborating with a wonderful group of um, people across the country for the Still Here National Hiroshima and Nagasaki um, anniversary, the 75th anniversary of the bombings. And we made some new friends and we're looking forward to continuing those collaborations this coming year and um, onward. Since COVID-19 put us all in our homes, we could at least reach out to people we wouldn't have otherwise. And that was a really special upside we weren't expecting for this year. So we're hoping to continue some of that work and force um, some of the groups in our coalition to um, jump on board with us. Force is probably not the right word, but um, convince them to jump on board with us and push for some new back from the brink resolutions in towns across the state and in the region um, to, it's a call to prevent nuclear war. And we are trying to get the Boston City Council and the Massachusetts legislature to also endorse back from the brinks like so many towns and cities across the country have done. Um, that will be our number one goal on the nuclear program for 2021. So please do um, consider checking out our website, gbpsr.org and giving to us if you're able. And we would love any volunteers in the Boston area to join our monthly meetings every first Monday of the month on Zoom right now and hopefully eventually back in person next year. Thanks so much.